Hello and welcome to the Birmingham Post Business Bulletin on Thursday, March the 11th. I'm Graham Brown. The day we've been prevaricating over for years has finally arrived. The government has announced plans for the £30 billion high-speed rail network which is going to give the city faster connections to London. And as we exclusively revealed in this week's edition of the Birmingham Post, a new station will be built in Eastside to serve the city centre. The station will be around the Curzon Street area and has been welcomed as a major boost for that part of the city. The route from Birmingham to London will begin running in 2017 and will reduce the journey time between the two cities by as much as 50 minutes. The proposed route will not take in Heathrow Airport which has become a political issue as the Conservatives were calling for it. In the latest issue of The Post which was released this morning we reported that community leaders and business people were delighted to see the scheme progressing. It will cost £30 billion in the fullness of time but the first part of the route between London and Birmingham is expected to cost up to £17.4 billion. You can read lots more about this in today's edition of, edition of the Birmingham Post and keep checking birminghampost.net for updates. In other news, the latest Forbes Rich List has been published and it shows that Microsoft founder Bill Gates is no longer the richest man on the planet. Mexican telecoms tycoon Carlos Slim has taken over at the top after amassing a $53.5 billion fortune. And closer to home, a creative company in the, in the city's custard factory has announced a major coup. Publisher Tyndall Street Press has revealed Sir Michael Lyons, the chairman of the BBC Trust, as its new chairman. Well, that's all from me today. Thank you for watching. We'll see you again tomorrow. Well, well, well.